With schools in the area slowly letting out, more teenage drivers will be out on the road looking for things to do. Law enforcement calls this time period the 100 deadliest days. Our Quran Alston has the details. From Memorial Day to Labor Day is labeled the 100 deadliest days for teen drivers. Yeah, so the 100 deadliest days of summer is, uh, is up on us. A lot of fatal crashes happen in this time period. According to the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration, nearly half of all teenage driving deaths take place during these 100 days. Uh, a lot of extra traffic, people traveling on the holidays. Uh, we just ask you to take your time to get to your destination slow down and definitely buckle up and wear those seatbelts. But how are schools in the area helping decrease those numbers? Parkersburg High School driving instructor teacher Sharon Marks has your answer. So when they first start driving, we always take them to a location that is fairly neutral, where there's not going to be a very complex intersections or a lot of vehicles. And then as they drive more and become a little bit more confident, uh, ultimately we'd like to get them on the interstate. But Grand Central always, is always a big task for them because it's so complex. For inexperienced teenage drivers, distractions are something that can cause a lot of accidents. But in her driving instruction, Marks tells the drivers to have a plan before they hit the road. So we always try to explain to them, have a plan. If, I tell them if you're in, if I'm in Columbus, which I know pretty well, but if I'm in an area that I don't really know, I'm prepared. If I get lost, I'm going to make a little route around. I'm going to find me a place for coffee. I'm going to figure out where I'm at and get back on the road. But always have a plan. Don't panic and don't say, I got to be there in 10 minutes. From Parkersburg, Cron Austin, WTAP News, this is home.